Careful, guys. Oh, we need more people. Munchkin was found out on Cape Cod, Massachusetts. They thought they saw what was a rock until they approached and they realized it was a giant sea turtle. When she came in, her temperature was very low. She was also underweight. The front right flipper and the rear flipper were both semi-amputated. She was not bright, alert, responsive. She wasn't active, and that's not what I wanted to see. Once we got Munchkin up to temperature, we then actually put her in um, one of our rehab tanks. I wanted to see her investigate her surroundings, dive to the bottom, and rest, and she didn't do that. And as she increased her nutrition and started to feel better and the antibiotics started to really take effect, we started to slowly see some changes. Today, she's a beautiful chestnut color and she's put back a lot of the weight that she lost. She's really looking robust, she's looking bright. Her skin color is great, her shell color is great. So, you know, this is what we want to see in a turtle. All sea turtles are threatened or endangered with climate change and pollution. So this center was built to help um, work on that problem. Munchkin was rescued about eight months ago. She now is just about ready for release. When Munchkin came in, she was about 300 pounds, and as of today, she's 330 pounds. As we prepare to release Munchkin, we're also preparing to track her after she leaves here. So in order to do that, I'll be working with Dr. Cara Dodge. We've never actually gotten tracking data from an adult loggerhead. So we're really excited to track Munchkin. The tag itself is relatively small compared to Munchkin. It's actually less than 1% of her body weight. She shouldn't even realize that tracker's there. It's a big day here. Not only did Munchkin survive, but that she gets to go back and hopefully add to the population of loggerhead turtles. Well, we'll be heading down to West Dennis Beach. This is a great beach because it faces a part of um, Nantucket Sound that, that is going to be great for the turtle. A lot of great energy, so many people there excited, you know, ready to see this turtle released. It's been a long eight months, it's been a hard eight months. So there's been a lot of planning that's been led to this day. It's always such a relief when they hit the water. I'm just happy, you know, really, really happy. It was really a beautiful sight to see her take a breath and look around a little bit and to really almost have dawn break over her. We only have three turtles left right now, and that is because the rest have all been released. So that's really good news. Munchkin is about 50 miles east of Atlantic City, New Jersey. The information we've collected so far looks fantastic. That makes us confident that rehabilitation was successful for this turtle and that she has a very promising future.
Like, comment, and subscribe.